All right, we made our way outside now of Doc Ondar's. And so in there, Connor got uh, four Kyber crystals. Uh, I think it's about every color. Uh, we'll explain to you at some point if he wants me to. One of all why, except red. Why he, oh, except red, okay. And I'll explain to you why he wanted to do that here in a little bit. Let's take a look at the Millennium Falcon here for a moment. So this will be a follow-up to what I mentioned at Galaxy's Edge. The Kyber crystals that you can buy from Doc Ondar's have RFID chips inside of them that tell a holocron which voice they have and tell your lightsaber which color it has. So, what you can do is, if you get a duplicate like what I have here, which is a Count Dooku crystal, you can use this little cheat sheet that someone found on Reddit that I'll put in the description to figure out which color is associated with which RFID number and which voice is associated with those. So what you do is buy yourself an RFID reader writer like this one and you can turn it on. Switch it to mode here, which is right there. Switch it to 125 kilohertz, which is the frequency that the RFID chips are inside of the kyber crystals. You put the kyber crystal right here up against the back of it. Now, some of these are cheaper than others. You can get them from anywhere between $20 to $60 on Amazon or eBay, whichever is your choice. Um, some of them will say that they don't write to the crystal, but do. So it's all just kind of a gamble um, that you have to just keep. It's just trial and error. You just figure out which one works and which ones don't. So you take it, you put your crystal there behind it, you hit input, and then you enter in the card number that you want. So in my case, it would be 3121, which is the one that I don't have. It's a uh, Vader 8 ball. So. You enter in the number, you press input again, it'll confirm your number for you, you place your crystal at the back, and then you hit right. Now, sometimes it'll say right failure like I mentioned, but let's see if it worked. So as you can see, it switched from being a Count Dooku crystal into being a Darth Vader 8-ball crystal. So that's really all it takes, just an RFID writer and a crystal and this cheat sheet, which like I said will be linked below, so you can use it to uh, switch whatever crystal to whatever you want. And it does not matter um, what color it is, you can change a red into being a blue or a white, you can do any of that. So it, yeah, it doesn't matter, you can change it to whatever you need. Alright, so that's it.